Hey everybody out there on YouTube, uh, I've got a very special video for today because look what just came in the mail. Yes, that's right. The Lionel 100th Anniversary Schilling Rail Zeppelin. And yes, it's all wound up and everything, so it's going to it's going to fly for us today, thankfully. And before anyone asks, no, I have absolutely zero intentions of turning this into a Thomas character. I know that there is one of these that is uh, in the show. I think his name's Hugo. That's what he's called. Um, but yeah, I have the Lionel version right here. I know Schilling made their own separate variant, which was all silver, just like the prototype. But this one is painted in a nice cream color with blue and orange accents to mimic uh, the Lionel branding. And this is the box it comes with. And of course it has some information on the back, like so. Nice little illustration of the Rail Zeppelin and the Schilling Company. And I'm gonna power it up and show you how it works. So yeah. So all you gotta do is flick this little button after you've wound up using the key. There's the keyhole right there. And of course it says, Lionel lines, and it's got the Lionel logo right there. And man, this thing just looks absolutely amazing. And I'm glad to add it to my wind-up train collection. So, here we go. Uh-oh. Come on. Hmm, that's odd. Okay, sorry for the technical difficulties. Now it'll go. Look at that prop spin. And there she stops. So here we have four other engines, or three I should say, sorry. So at this end, we have a Marx 897, circa 1938 with tender and as you can see looks pretty good sized up next to it although it's a bit shorter but still it's almost just as long here we have a Lionel 040 tender engine um, this is basically the same as a 1615 engine it's my lion chief one of course and it is quite tall and quite wide compared to this small slim street streamlined engine. And then next to that I have my custom Ertl um, Clockwork Thomas the Tank engine. It doesn't actually work, it's just a push unit, but yeah. I think that pretty much sums up its size fairly well. And again, I thank all of you for watching this video, and I hope that um, you think about buying this. If you ever see it at a train show, train store, or online, don't hesitate, buy it today. It's a very fun little gift and a very amazing little engine. All right, see you guys later.